guys, I want to show you my uh, recent uh, purchase. Obviously, as you can see, I've been doing um, whole other purchasing fragrances from Federico Mahora. And why is that? Because they are so cheap and so good. And in these times, it's so hard, you know, with the money last year and uh, basically, yeah. So I like to save wherever I can. Um, if you like to do the same, then watch this video, that's something for you. If you like the fragrances and save the money, that's for you. And if you like to smell, still great. So, recently I bought this one, this is um, Pure Royal from Federico Mahora perfume. And as you know, they are numbered, so this is number 823, the number you can see at the back. And this is inspired by Tom Ford Fabulous. Um, the fragrance is actually fabulous as the name, right? Um, this is this doesn't have the name, this only has got the number. Uh, Federico Mahora scents usually have got just the number. This is how you can recognize the fragrances. And it comes in 50 ml and it's uh, pure royal. It's marketed as for men, but um, so it doesn't come in green uh, packaging. Uh, like the others, uh, which uh, is unisex, green packaging is unisex, so this one comes in uh, packaging for men in a black one, but um, obviously you can still use it in ladies or men. Anyway, I'm gonna open this box, it comes in this beautiful box, um, and the bottle inside is also gorgeous got something written there, engraved in a bottle, in a glass, which is uh, Pure Royal, it says Pure Royal there, there it says number again, 823, Pure Royal, you can just take it out from there, it's gorgeous packaging as well, so um, that's what bottle look, looks like, and now let's get to the scent, I've already sprayed it, I've tried it, it's amazing guys, like it says, it's fabulous! <laughs> You wanna smell fabulous? Get Federico Mahora 83. You will smell fabulous. <laughs> so I'm just gonna spray it again. It's got amazing sprayer as well. It's, it comes in a nice uh, silver atomizer on the top. And then you just uh, put black top. Black. And uh, the juice in it is quite um, transparent. So it doesn't really have a color or anything. Mm, this is amazing guys, this is, oh, this is so nice, uh, I tell you the notes, um, the head, the top notes are um, wild lavender, clary sage, in the heart we've got vanilla blossom, iris and almond, and in base we've got cashmere musk, tonka bean, leather and ambergris, so um, this fragrance is, it smells very luxurious, very posh. You will smell very, um, very posh, very rich, right? This is a rich fragrance, fragrance of the rich. <laughs> Guys, what does it smell like? It smells, apart from smelling rich and luxurious and posh, it smells a uh, sort of mixture of freshness, Slight, slightly like sourness, I would say, but s sort of like like citrusy, fresh, um, sour, like everything together, and a little bit like um, powdery, and very, very slightly sweet. So and kind of earthy, woody. If it makes sense. It's a mixture of all these things together, but it's blended very nicely, and it's so it's very well balanced. Um, it's not sweet at all, like uh, it's not sweet, 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 right? It's not sweetness like you would see in some other sweet fragrances at all. I would say more like it's leaning more like to woody scents and like you know colder scents. And um, at the beginning. It's it's kind of at the opening. I mean, it's kind of more like soury, like quite fresh, if it makes sense. And then 
when it dries down after about 10 minutes 15 minutes uh, you've got this vanilla coming through and iris which gives it um, this you know powdery scent and then uh, I guess it's got very slightly but very not very noticeable and um, this almond aroma this nutty aroma but it's not very noticeable I think what's very noticeable in there is this clary sage and lavender at the opening but it's so nicely blended you know so it's sort of, sort of like calming fragrance as well I guess you could wear it into bed as well it's gonna calm you down <laughs> but it's very pleasant it's very inviting fragrance as well it's very very pleasant it's beautiful and then when you when you get um, to, the, to the base to the dry down where is cashmere mask you can clearly say it's um, I think you can smell a uh, cashmere mask and leather quite a lot and just a slightly sweetness from tonka bean um, yeah but it's so everything is so beautifully balanced and blended you can't even detect anything um, uh, coming too much out of the fragrance <laughs> if it makes sense <laughs> yeah and uh, it's very unisex it's very unisex this one so it doesn't matter if you're lady or a man it's very unisex both can wear it it's absolutely gorgeous it's beautiful it's my recent discovery I realized I really love this one <laughs> it's just amazing it's awesome this one and the packaging helps as well it's just beautiful it's gonna be my another favorite one I think mm. I, I keep smelling it like how else I could describe it so I'm, I'm sure you will get compliments with this one because you will get noticed with this one and it's very pleasant smell it's sort of like inviting so um, this this fragrance is very good um, on any occasion like um, you can wear it anywhere on a walk basically to the shop you can wear it on a date night it's not sweet sweet so I wouldn't probably think of date night like too much I think on date night you need a little bit more sweet fragrances but it's there is something about this fragrance so even if you put it on a date night if you're going on a date or you know on valentine or something um, there is something attractive about this scent so I think you will still attract the other one it's a very very uh, pleasing a very inviting fragrance so it's not offending you know it's it's non, non offensive fragrance. Yeah, it's just gorgeous. I just can't stop smelling it. Ah, it's so good. <laughs> very, very good. Um, so I think uh, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this review. Uh, I'll link some um, uh, links down below in the description box. And I hope you um, will like it if you get hands on it. It's basically um, like the Tom Ford. Fragrance, so and it la does last. Yeah, the longevity is amazing. It does last until next day. And um, sillage, sillage is pretty good as well. It, it's it's not gonna fill the room, but it, it's very good. Um, the other person is definitely gonna smell it. Mm, this is so good.